If you can believe you can do something, you do it better. It's good to be home. One of New York's most legendary baseball figures, Gilbert Ray Hodges, was born on April 4th, 1924, in Princeton, Indiana. Gil debuted as a Brooklyn Dodger in 1943, but after appearing in just a single game, he was sent to the Pacific to fight in World War II, earning a bronze star. Upon his return to the big leagues in 1947, Gill established himself as one of the most prolific power hitters in the game, as well as one of the top defensive first basemen. In 1962, he was a member of the inaugural New York Mets team, clubbing the first home run in franchise history. There's a drive deep to the left field. This one could go all the way. But goes back by the ball. He can't get to it a home run. An eight-time All-Star, Gill returned to the Mets as skipper in 1968, leading the team to its best record to that date. The next season, of course, he managed a miracle. I think this year proved that this ball club is going to be in contention for the championship for many years to come. There's a fly ball hit out to left, waiting is Jones. The Mets are the world champion. Look at this scene. Just thank uh, the commissioner uh, for this beautiful trophy and certainly all the wonderful players that we had this year that have done such an outstanding job and we must not forget all the beautiful fans that we had in Chase Stadium all year long. It's just been a great year. A heart attack in the spring of 1972 brought Gill's life to an end just two days shy of his 48th birthday. But he will always be counted among our city's most beloved athletes. Gilbert Ray Hodges, a champion, a legend, and now a Baseball Hall of Famer.